Hey everyone, it's Lily720. Today we will be continuing with The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past. Um, we're here in the witch's hut. Um, after you give the witch the mushroom, if you go like one screen over and then come back and go in the hut, the magic powder is right there next to the assistant. So we can just go up to it and press A. I didn't know you had to press A, my bad. Um, this is magic powder. Try to sprinkle it on enemies and many other things. Um, sure, yeah, we can do that. Uh... I'll talk to the assistant. The th she says the same thing every time, but um, I just talked to her to uh, refill my hearts. Motherfucker. <clears throat> That's okay. We can get our hearts refilled again, and now that we have done that, uh, first I'm gonna spray, or not spray, sprinkle magic powder on this thing. And it turns into the funny thing. I think this might actually be a Cukeman. Can I talk to it? Tralala, -la, look for Sahasrala. Thanks, buddy. Oh, you mother effer. Okay, one more time. And this is the last time, and then we'll move on. I don't know. I have this obsession with having full hearts, and it kind of pisses me off when I do something stupid right after getting full health. Anyway. Okay, now we want to make our way back. Uh, I guess to the sanctuary we'll go first. I kind of just want to go to the castle. That's where we have to go next. But, um, yeah, we'll go see what we can do. Okay, we outran him. Good. Yeah, we'll go see what we can do at the sanctuary, which it won't be, like, anything, because, you know, all the bad shit has happened already. So if we come up here, he's like laying there like, Oh, Link, you are a second too late. I have failed. Zelda, the soldiers have abducted her. They have taken her to the castle. You must find her before the wizard works his magic. Please, you are our only hope. And he disappears into, I don't know, the void or the nether or the wherever the hell he goes. Um, I don't want the magic powder equipped anymore. Um, so yeah. Did he say to go to the castle? I totally did not listen to him. And, yeah, he says you're a second too late, but that's not true. It doesn't matter. Well, I mean, it probably is true, but it doesn't matter how fast you get there. Um, you're always going to be a second too late. That's why I don't rush. I do other things. Um... Like, not fall in the water, but also, like, try to find my way back to the castle. Alright. Wait. Yeah, okay. Just a little disoriented. I usually... Um... Don't start from where I started. <laughs> um, today, so... You know, I'm a little bit out of sync. I kind of like don't have my bearings quite yet, but uh, it doesn't matter because now we're at the castle and we'll be able to go in and kick some ass. Oh, no, go up, go up, go up. Keep going up and we're in, yes. Alright, so this part we're familiar with and uh, we really don't need to go through like all that we went through the first time, um, this time. I hope that sentence made sense. Uh, we just go to either the left or right and then come out one of these um, exits onto the, like, the upper level. And, uh, you know, we have this thing here. Normally we couldn't do anything, or before we couldn't do anything. Now, the Master Sword takes care of it in one hit. And we can go in. And we have this little eye symbol on the ground, which is kind of... I don't know if it's actually considered this, but I think of it as, like, the like symbol of a Ghanim. It's not quite a Sheikah symbol, even though I know that that comes later, but uh, it comes later game-wise, earlier story-wise. I don't want to get into, into timeline shit, though. Um, anyway, no. Okay, now we have these guys to worry about, and I don't know how much life they take, but I'm just gonna stand here and hit them with my beams because I can, and now we can move on, and I got the rupee, yeah. Uh, anyway, so like the eye symbols, kind of like a symbol of a Ghanim, I guess. It's usually, it usually means he's, like when you see it on the ground, it's like, this is his territory, you know? And also like, 
aside from the uh, Shika symbol in Ocarina of Time, uh, because that's also an I, I think. Sorry, I get confused kind of a lot, and uh, I don't know why. I also have never, I've seen most of Ocarina of Time being played. Oh, and I've seen like a couple of walkthroughs, but I never actually played it myself, so I get a little confused. Um, and as I'm talking, I'm confused in here with what to do. Uh, finding a key, obviously, is one thing I need to do. Um, but that should be somewhere. That did something. What did that do? Did that open a door? Anyway, back to my eyeball thing. Um, pretty sure a Sheikah symbol is an eye. Um, other than that, like eyes just tend to be evil in Zelda Land. In Hyrule. Like, I don't, I don't really know what it is. That switch at the bottom left must have opened that door that we came through. I guess? I don't really see what else it could have done. Anyway, we get the key from that chest and then come through here. I, this looks like a room we were in earlier. It's just dark now. And... I guess, technically, this would be, like, the f uh, fourth dungeon. Well, it could also be considered the fifth if you count the first time you go through Hyrule Castle as the first dungeon, but I don't, and I don't count this as the fourth dungeon. I say... Um, I just say Hyrule Castle. Like, with the other ones, you know, it's like the East Palace is, like, the first dungeon, and then Desert Palace is second, Tower of Hera third. Um, but I don't think of Hyrule Castle as fourth. I just think of it as Hyrule Castle. I don't know what I don't know what that switch does, I don't really care, and that soldier fell down, so it's a good day. Well, you just freaking die, and we got a key, yay. Um, so basically, like, there's- it's not like a puzzle or anything, like other Zelda dungeons, you just keep going through the rooms and killing all the enemies. If there is no key, it's usually you just have to kill the enemies to open the door. And that was totally my fault. I totally walked into that red guy. And just kill that guy. They keep dropping these big magic things. Listen well, Link. Even with the Master Sword, you cannot inflict physical harm on the wizard. You must find a way to return his own evil magic power to him. <laughs> I think even earlier, like, Sahasrila said, like, you can use the Master Sword, like, to deflect evil or something. That's pretty much what we're going to be doing. It's not a difficult battle at all. God, with the freaking... Like, how many rooms of enemies does one boss need? Like, good god. Because, again, you know, it's not like a, a puzzle or anything. This... Like, I'm not confused about what to do. Well, I mean, sometimes I am, but that's just because I'm like, oh, where's the key? And that's just because I'm an idiot and, like, not always paying attention. And, um, yeah, but other than that, other than me being stupid, like, this isn't really difficult. Like, you need to just kill things. If there's no chest, the thing will drop the, uh, oh, shit. The, the, the enemy, an enemy will drop a... We'll drop a key if there's no if there's no key in a chest. And I like that we have this whole family of soldiers. Because they look a little different than from the normal Hylian soldiers. And how many freaking hits can you possibly take? Thank you for dying. Okay. I hope are we like almost there? I don't know. I don't really care too much for Hyrule Castle. I swear to friggin' god, if I die, I'm gonna be really pissed off with myself. No, I don't like this. I'm going to fall. Oh. Oh my god. I am awesome. <laughs> I am psychic. I totally called myself on the fact that I was going to fall. Alright. 
straight stairs. We don't have them a lot. This is usually a sign of something good. Oh, yep. See? Eyeball symbol. I bet a Ghanim is right on the other side of this. Yep. Right on the other side of this door. Aha! Link, I have been waiting for you. Hehehe. <laughs> I was hoping I could make Zelda vanish in front of your eyes. Behold! The last moment of Princess Zelda! And another seizure-inducing scene, like the one in the intro to this game. Ho ho ho! With this, the seal of the seven wise men is at last broken. It is now only a matter of time before evil power covers this land. After all, the legendary hero cannot defeat us, the tribe of evil, when we are armed with the power of gold. Ho ho ho, now I must go. And I love that there are- oh, I didn't know I couldn't go down that way. I have to go around. Anyway, I love that it's like, oh, where could he be? Oh, it's the center one, you know, where he went through. Here we have the battle with Aghanim. Oh, so? You mean to say you would like to be totally destroyed? Well, I can make your wish come true. Um, so basically, he's gonna move around the room and send these energy balls at you, and you just wanna, like, fling them back to him. Uh, you don't wanna stand, like, too far away, because then they'll kinda deflect sideways. Um, that one with, like, the four blue energy balls, uh, you, you can hit it with your sword and they'll burst, but, um... Those you can't hit back at him. It's these like round um, blinking ones. And when he goes up in the center like that, he usually does a lightning attack. That one got a little close, but uh, if you just stand off to the side, you should be fine. He usually, like, he'll maybe aim a little bit. It's just like, he'll be a little, like if you're standing on the left, the lightning will go a little left of the center, but it y usually doesn't hit you. Like. I don't think I've ever been hit by the lightning, unless I was being an idiot and like standing in the center. Like, watch. Please don't hit us then. Okay, good. Oh, see, he even went to the right. And had I been standing in the right corner, I actually would have been hit. Um, basically you just do this. Not really sure how many hits it takes. Um, the only thing I guess I would grow bored. That's the only reason I would want to know. But anyway, that was the last one. Well met, like the true hero that you are. But I am not ready to admit defeat yet. I will draw you into the dark world. Die, motherfucker! Die! Oh, okay, that did nothing. And here we are in the dark world. Link, it is I, Sahasrala. I am communicating to you across the void through telepathy. The place where you now stand was the Golden Land, but evil power turned it into the Dark World. The wizard has broken the wise men's seal and opened a gate to link the worlds at Hyrule Castle. In order to save this half of the world, the Light World, you must win back the Golden Power. You must also rescue the seven maidens who Aghanim sent to the Dark World. As members of the bloodline of the seven wise men, they have power that will surely help you. The maidens are locked in hidden dungeons full of evil creatures and dangerous traps. The Palace of Darkness should be your first goal in this world. Link, I can rely on only you. Please make this old man's wishes come true. I beg you. And there we go. Now we are in the dark world. We defeated a Ghanim, sort of, for the first time. And we are here in the dark world. And this is where we're going to stop for now. And we'll be able to move on to the second half of this game um next time so until then thank you very much for watching i'll see you later